Good morning and welcome to the Mike Show for Friday, January 6, 2023. Oh, 33 degrees at 9 at 10:23 a.m. and I'm your host Bob Kamal. And I'm a sinner and I'm a tired sinner and it's happy Friday. We just had between 50 and city, 60 city chickens out there feeding. We got a pair of mallards. And there they go. <laughs> Mikey's still outside. Max, Sully, and Samuel were out. Here comes neighbor Steve, two days in a row, for the eight billion of you who were not tuned in yesterday. There's another view of neighbor Steve. What's he up to today? Oh boy. I think this might be a three carafe coffee morning to get me moving and awake and get the uh, dust and the cobwebs out of the gears that run my brain. I'm gonna need lots of oil and grease. Oh boy. I'm tired, and my shoulder hurts like you would not believe. Having a little difficulty breathing, too. But, you know, that's the way it is. Just the way it is. It's already Friday. The first Friday of January of the new year. And today, if I'm not mistaken, we are going to have one minute and ten seconds more daylight than we did yesterday. And if you want to know how much more we're going to have tomorrow, I think you might have to tune in tomorrow because I didn't check. I'm not apologizing. I do very little of that. There's that Sullivan. I apologize to these guys for letting them down all the time. I fall short every day of trying to understand their needs and taking care of them. But I do the best I can. And they love me. They forgive me. Don't you, sweetheart? Don't you, sweetheart? Where's that Mikey? Mikey's still outside. Let me see Sam. Oh, look at There's Sam. There's Sammy. Come on, Sam. Sammy is the sweetest soul in the world. Yeah. Chiefy was a sweet, sweet soul, too, but... Don't make me try to tell you who was sweeter because I couldn't live on the difference. And I don't think there was any difference. Look at that Sullivan. He sees he sees Mikey coming. Ugh. Come on, Mikey. Come on, Poppy. Oh, Bobby. Oh, boy. Come on, Sully. Come on, Mikey. Come on in, honey. Come on, Poppy. Oh. Gonna have a little standoff there. Might as well just commit and say they're having a Mexican standoff. There's that Samuel. I love you, Bobby. Oh, he purred me so much last night. City chickens scattered into groups and are flying all over in a Aeronautical Ballet. Looks like we might have had some deer feeding out there last night. Oh, there's neighbor Steve again. He keeps bringing out white five-gallon pails. Oh, boy. We're going to take a break. Let me see him. I love you so much. How could you not love that little face? Yeah. Oh, Sammy. Oh, yeah, we can't forget about the old Tanzanian pea berry. All right, we're going to take a break here. Welcome back, and I don't mean that one little bit. We're trying to be the least watched show on YouTube. We get information from YouTube telling us that people are actually watching this shit and subscribing. And it just boggles the mind. 
It just boggles the mind. On occasional days and videos when I got something not something interesting to show like a color tour, a bike ride, or jumping in the lake at Rockport when whatever normal people are doing that time of the year isn't swimming. Um, you know, that might be worth a look, but a peek into my daily daily life. It's not. To me, it is. I don't know. It's the only life I got, and it's where I ended up. We're back again. It is another mild, unseasonably warm for the time of year day. And there's like a mist out there, and every once in a while you see some Snow, tiny snowflakes fluttering around. Oh boy. So a recap from yesterday, if I can remember back that far, which today's not going to be easy to do. There's that Sullivan. There's Bobby. There's that Bobby. We uh, didn't do much, that's for sure. Drove over to Dollar General to pick up some Q-tips and things like that. Scored a case of food for the cats. Their favorite salmon pate. And uh, we hung out and watched Indiana Jones. And the Last Crusade. No. Raiders of the Lost Ark. And we watched... What else did we watch, Sully? We watched a Sherlock Holmes movie, and what did we watch for a historical documentary last night? This is tough. Oh boy, the brain is soft today, that's for sure. I think we better take a break and think about it. I remember now. It was... Episode 2 of Season 8 of Endeavor, which was pretty good. So anyway, we did make liver and onions for dinner with some used food salad. Um, I overcooked the onions that I was making. I sautéed some onions and some butter and garlic. And when I went to put the liver on, I had realized I should have put it on a little sooner because by the time the liver and the onion liver was finished the onions were a little bit too brown but it was still good oh boy I think lentil soup's on the on the agenda today what do you think Sully hmm? what do you think Poppy Liz Hurley's Jubblies are 57 years, 210 days, 3 hours, and 49 minutes old. That is if they're original material. 47 city chickens out on the wire right now. Oh boy. Oh boy. We're back again, and I think just to get us out the door today, that's the hardest part. In fact, that's one of my touchstone readings. <laughs> City chickens are moving in. Um, but just to get us out that door and get us out moving around and getting some fresh air, I think we're going to the post office today to mail a bill. Yeah. Where's that touchstone book? There's the city chickens coming down. And it's an old Dutch proverb. He who is outside the door has already a good part of his journey behind him. And with that, we're going to say... 
from the cold gray ashes and coals of my cold black heart and my broken, beaten, battered, bruised, bloody, burdened, empty, hollow, cracked, shattered, hopeless, forsaken, and forlorn soul. And I merely mean this. Piss off. Happy Friday and thanks for not tuning in.